discovered posting covers on YouTube. Her music continues to climb the charts and she has performed across the globe for thousands of fans. Here tonight for a special performance, please welcome Dua Lipa. Thank you so much. Welcome. Thank you. This is insane. This is a I little. I can't believe it. You guys, <laughs> you guys are amazing. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you. I love you. Now, these people have been waiting for hours and hours. I don't know if you know this. Thank you. Thank you so much for waiting. You have some pretty dedicated fans. <laughs> these are beautiful people. Uh, but I feel like we should just cut right to the chase, y'all. Y'all have been waiting. Do you feel like we should just jump right into some music? Yeah, let's do okay. it. Okay. Take it away. Hi. Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. Thank you so much for coming down to see me. Um, give a massive round of applause for Kai, who's joining me. All right, if you guys know the song, please sing along. <laughs> Tell me I'm too crazy, you can tame me, can tame me Tell me I have changed, but I'm the same me, oh, same me Inside, come on, hey, hey, hey If you don't like the way I talk, then why am I on your mind? If you don't like the way I rock, then finish your glass of wine We fight and we argue, you'll still let me blind If we don't fuck this whole thing, I'm guaranteed I can blame and tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign. Guaranteed I could blow your mind. And tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign. Guaranteed I could blow your mind. Mwah. Yeah, I'm so bad. Best that you find. I guess you're digging the show. Mm -hmm. Open the door. You want some more? When you want to leave, let me know Tell me I'm too crazy, you can tame me, can tame me Tell me I have changed, but I'm the same me, oh, same me Inside, as loud as you can, hey, hey If you don't like the way I walk, then why am I on your mind? If you don't like the way I rock, then finish your glass of wine We fight and we argue, you'll still love me I can blow your mind, and tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign. Guaranteed, I can blow your mind. And tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign. Guaranteed, I can blow your mind. Mwah. Tell me I'm too crazy. You can tame me, can tame me. Tell me I have changed, but I'm the same me, oh same me. Inside. If you don't like the way I talk, then why am I on your mind? If you don't like the way I rock, then finish your glass of wine. We fight and we argue, you'll still love me blind. If we don't fuck this whole thing, I'm guaranteed I can blow your mind. And tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign, guaranteed I can blow your mind. And tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign, guaranteed I can blow your mind. Thank you so much. Never mind. Oh, I'm blind.
Okay, all right, so um, we've also decided to do a couple covers tonight that we've, um, that we've never done before. So I'm a bit nervous, but I'm really excited. <laughs> um, okay, all right, let's do it. Seeing you got ritualistic Cleansing of my soul of addiction for now Cause I'm falling apart Tension between us just like picket fences you got issues that I won't mention for now Cause we're falling apart Passionate from miles away Passive with the things you say Passing up on my own ways I can't blame you, no No from miles away Passive with the things you say Passing up on my own ways I can't blame you, no No Listen Heart at building trust from a distance I think we should rule out commitment for now Cause we're falling apart Hey Leaving You're just doing that to get even Don't pick up the pieces, just leave it for now They keep falling apart Sing it with me if you know it Passionate from miles away Passive with the things you say Passing up on my own ways I can't blame you, no No Passionate from miles away Passive with the things you say Passing up on my own ways I can't blame you, no no, 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 no. Thank you so much. Oh man, you guys are so much fun. I was so nervous coming out and I heard that so many of you are here. Thank you for being so much fun. I love you guys too. And I'm so excited to come back and do a show here. All right, this next song is called Thinking About You. Three of my neighbors hate me. Music blasting, shaking these walls. This time, Mary Jane won't save me. I've been working later. I've been drinking stronger. I've been smoking deeper, but the memories won't stop. I can't stop thinking about you. Like poison coursing through me So clear my vision is blurry But A's won't put my mind 
I've been working later, I've been drinking stronger, I've been smoking deeper, but the memories won't stop. I can't stop thinking about you. I can't stop thinking about you. I can't get high, I can't get by, I can't get through. I can't stop thinking about you. cover and then I'm gonna start answering some questions yeah all right go for it <laughs> you guys need to stop <laughs>
guys so much. Incredible. Wow. I mean, that was incredible. I, Thank I you also so much. love um, the audience is living. <laughs> you guys are so much fun. Thank you so much. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> I mean, uh, some of my favorite commentary I heard from the crowd living legends. Okay. Uh, we stand talents. Thank you. And, and of course, vocals. <laughs> Thank Did you. Did someone just put the hand up? Like, that was me. Okay. <laughs> I'll take credit for it. I mean, but it, it had to start somewhere. And I feel like a lot of people here obviously probably know, um, you got started posting covers. You, you, you started sharing covers, and now you are being covered. You are somebody who's being covered. So... Tell us about your experience with YouTube, because, yeah, it came from there. Um, well, I, you know, to begin with, I guess I never really knew how I was ever going to get to be right here, right now. And so I thought that the only, like, the, the, the only way I could do it was, I guess, use social media to my advantage. And I was like, I at least just want the kids at school to know that I, I sing and... Exactly, a networker. <laughs> um, a businesswoman. A businesswoman. Work. Oh, <laughs> this is too fun. I know. This is too fun. <laughs> um, and so, and so, that's what I did. But I never really had the kind of. It never had that kind of viral effect, but it served me as a kind of portfolio where I would just go up to people that were in music and I'd be like, "Hey, if you like my covers and if you like my voice, maybe we could get in the studio and write together." And I really just kind of started like that and started writing songs. You guys, look at them. I'm I like, know. I can't. It's like... <laughs> it's so funny because before we came out, you were just like, I'm so nervous. And I'm like, trust me, they love you. <laughs> like, <laughs> what? I mean, there's got to be, there's got to be so many people out there, probably at home, there's so many people watching, not just in the room right now, but also watching live. Uh, and if you are, use the hashtag, hashtag new rules live. Thank you. But for the people that are at home wanting to follow in those types of footsteps, what advice would you give to them? Um, believe in your talent. Yeah. Always believe in your talent. Because um, you have to believe in, your first, in yourself first before anybody else does. Um, be very persistent. And... Um, I say just go for it, don't be scared. Be confident and, and don't take no for an answer. You gotta answer. take that leap, yeah. So if you were that 15-year-old today and you were on YouTube, you log in, blah, 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 and you're like, hmm, what should I cover? What would you be covering today? If you were just getting started, what songs would you want to cover? New rules, I'm joking. Um, Besides new rules. Um, I love Malibu by Miley Cyrus. Yeah. Oh, we've got a scream. I love that song. Um, I don't know, there's there's so much great music. I'm loving like Lord and SZA. I think they're both so great. And um, there's, I don't know, there's just so much great music out who at the moment stand? that it's kind of- Like, who are you like, love? Pink. Pink, okay. I stand Pink. Is I she stand like your her queen? So hard. Yeah. yeah, I love her, I love her. Um, I, 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 I just love, you know, who she is as an artist yeah. and kind of, what she stood for, and I absolutely loved her speech at the VMAs. And yeah, I think I think she's brilliant. And yeah. like you, exactly. So the video for New Rules, I mean, the reaction has been phenomenal. It's out of control. Everyone is covering it. People are doing parodies of it. Of it. Uh, people are getting hashtag Do As New Rules trending on Twitter. I mean. How has it been to see... It is the Song of Summer, yeah. How has it been to see your fans connect with it so much? I mean, it resonates with your fans. It's been... It's really exciting. You know, it's... It's, it's always exciting when you release a song for the first time. Obviously, you guys heard the song when the album came out. So it was really exciting for so many 
new people to hear about the song and also to hear about me through the video. Like the video, I feel connected with people in a, in a completely different way. And it, it took me by surprise because I just kind of, I, I just went and did something that I was really passionate about and I wanted to kind of put out, you know, another side to the story of what the song is about, but kind of relate it to, to, to my everyday life and how I would go about telling my friends this and I would, how I would want to be looked after and I, how I would want to look after. And um, so it's, it's really nice to see people reacting to it and, and responding the way they have. So thank you. Now, the, the, the song itself, the lyrics are uh, inspirational. They, they are a good guide to life if you need somebody to show you the way. Which of the rules is the hardest, do you think, to follow? They're not easy rules. Okay, right, right, right. I, they have a point. They have a point. What? Rule number one is the hardest because the second you pick up the phone, then you've got you you fall in for two, okay. three, and four. Like yeah. it's gone. It's a snowball effect. Yeah, it's a snowball effect. So number one. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, if you're if you're over him, you ain't getting. If you're under him, you ain't getting over him. If you were to add another rule, maybe there's a remix in the future with more rules. More. What rules are missing? Um, what, like, you, you've seen the world, what rules do you think, oh, I should have included that? Right, don't check his social media. Do not check his social Block. media. Um, Mute. <laughs> what, cut, right, yeah, exact. New phone, who dis? Don't send him a letter. Um, don't fax him. Don't fax him. Don't page him. Do not send him a carrier pigeon. Do not, no, no. <laughs> Message in a bottle. Not a message in a no bottle. Mes yeah, oh I, don't, I don't know. You guys have to help me with the new rules. But I think we've got three good ones for now. Yeah. So new rules is, uh, I would say, a message of empowerment. And it really, it really focuses, at least also in the music video, on the importance of these relationships and these friendships, especially with women with women. Like, these friendships are important. Why was it so important? important for you to tell that narrative and to show and shine a light on the importance of friendship relationships? Um, well, because me growing up, I guess my friends are my family um, and I'm, I'm very, very close to them. And I, like I said, like I'll, I would do anything for them and I'd look after them and, and, and they mean the world to me and they would do the same for me. And I think it's really important, not just girls looking after girls, but just looking after each other. I think it's so important, in, especially currently now what's happening in the world. There's nothing more important than looking after each other. I love that. That's beautiful. So this has got to have felt like a whirlwind. I mean, like, we've stand, but a lot of people... A lot of people are finding I out about you. you. I love you. I do, I stand, truly. <laughs> it's easy to stand when the vocals are there. It's like... <laughs> Talent is easy to stand. So this has got to be, does it feel like a whirlwind? Is every new experience, because you're going on tour, you're doing your own tour, you are with legends. Like, how, is it, how does it feel? It's insane. It's, it's you know, it's, a, it's overwhelming at times, but I've never been so grateful in my life for all the experiences that have been kind of thrown at me. I, 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 I mean, I couldn't thank you guys enough for all the support you guys have given me and the love. And because of you guys, I'm here today. So thank you so much. And it's, it's, just been, it's just been insane. Like, every day I wake up and I do something different and I learn something different. And some days you don't have such a good day, but even from those days, you kind of learn from it. And, and that's what I'm thankful for the most. I love that. Now, your vocals obviously, obviously speak for themselves, but a lot of people might not know that you also write the songs. You are a part of that process. How has your songwriting uh, career kind of changed, or how has it evolved since maybe you first started and now today? Has there been an evolution? How have yeah, you seen that? Yeah, it's been a massive learning curve for me. When I first started, I guess I was, I was kind of nervous of my own thoughts and how to be able to kind of put them down and have maybe one day someone hear them or know that it was about them. That's or vulnerable. It's, it's, it's scary. And yeah. especially when, because when, I, I write with, with other people as well. And, um, you know, going into a room with people that you don't necessarily know so well to kind of open up and not be afraid that they might think something of you. But it was, it was something that was a massive barrier for me. And I only realized that the, the, the only way I could get the most honest song 
out of myself was, was no, the only person that could get an honest song out of me was me. And so I just had to go out there and just be honest and not be afraid of it. And um, I made some amazing friends along the way. The, uh, the collaborations <laughs> that you've done with other songwriters, are there people that you loved working with? Are there specific writers that you would I love to go back with? I loved working with Miguel. Yeah. He is... He is so talented and, and such an amazing writer. He's and, really handsome, too. And you think he's very handsome, and he is very handsome. He's a man. Yeah. <laughs> um, and and he's, he's, he's just, he's a true artist, and I, I really appreciate his work. Are there artists that you would love to collaborate with in songs that you maybe haven't done yet? Maybe this, this can be a chance for... The, your wonderful audience to be like, okay, let's get yeah. this going. Well, what do you, what do you guys think? Anita? Anita. Anita. <laughs> Beyonce. Beyonce. I mean, I, I think Troy. I heard. I mean, there are so many amazing artists. Uh, that's the. I heard Dalai Lama. Somebody da said Dalai, Dalai Lama. Lama. The possibilities yes. are endless. Yeah. yeah. Uh, P.S. I heard. Is this true or false? Tell me, did your US and your UK tour, there's hell down? <laughs> not completely, not completely. <laughs> oh, they're almost We've, there. Well, yeah, they're almost there. Um, we, we actually just upgraded Houston, Dallas, and Chicago, oh babe. <laughs> um, <laughs> Go off, no, no keep going. No, stop, 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 stop. It's not very often where so you are, shy. you have that many people that want to see you and then the demand is even bigger by the time and it sells out and you have to make it an even bigger venue. It's like, that's yeah, incredible. Yeah, and I heard someone say something about New York. Yeah. I'm really excited to come down and, and I know that it sold out really fast. And Like that. Thank, I, I want to thank you guys so much for buying tickets, the people that did buy tickets. And I wanted, I wanted to try and upgrade the venue, but I, I couldn't because the next venue up was way too big, and so I'm gonna try and come back next time. But I promise I'll be back. You know I'm always gonna come back. So, um, you know I'm always gonna come back. I'll never leave you. I love New York. So, um, obviously I wanna thank you guys, the guys that are gonna come down to Hammers Hammerstein, Hammerstein Ballroom. <laughs> Hammerstein Ballroom. Um, it's gonna be lots of fun. See you there, babe. <laughs> Okay, right, um, so I have asked enough questions. I feel like we have some questions in the audience right now. So we got them ahead of time. Don't fret. We got you. Uh, the first question comes from Victoria Augusta. Are you here somewhere? Say hello. Hi. <gasps> Hi, hello. Victoria. So Victoria wants to know, if you had to get one of your own lyrics tattooed on you, which would it be and why? I, I don't think I would. <laughs> <laughs> Personally, um, I, I, I have a song that I wrote a while ago, um, which is called For Julian, which I wrote for a friend of mine. And there's one, one lyric in there that, that I really love, that um, one can drown alone, but we can swim together. And I, I think, um, I, think I, I, I do that. If you I did that. To. You wrote that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Brianna, who is also known as Beyonce, apparently. <laughs> Hi, Brianna. <laughs> uh, Brianna wants to know, how long did it take to film the one cut scene in New Rules, the music video, perfectly? Um, so it, it took us about 10 takes. Oh. But we did two days of rehearsal. So we, we did practice a lot for two days with the girls to make sure that on the day that we filmed, because obviously time's so limited when, when you're shooting a video and you're trying to do everything in one day, we tried to do as much in the rehearsal so that when we do it on the day, it would be nearly perfect every time. <laughs> it, the final product was very quality. We were Thank happy. Uh, can we also talk about the gays version? Yes! Jake Wilson. Jake Wilson, like, did that also. Yes, that was amazing. The attention to Dita was so good, and the Justin Bieber Yeah, Oh, my God, part, yeah, yeah. I was like, it's just, it's genius. What was Why your, what was your gut reaction it? when you first saw that? Were you, like, gasping? Well, all my friends, literally on the same day, had sent it to me. Well, yeah. And I was like, this is amazing. I watched it on repeat, like, three times. I was like, this is so good. The outfits, the... 
the water, the swimming pool. I want to know whose house that is. <laughs> the ambiance. And if they want to have a party. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Jake Belmelli, where are you? Hi, Jake. Hi. Jake would like to know, one time you said, New York feels like home to me. Right. Why do you feel that way? I mean, obviously, look at these people, but yeah. Yeah. Um, I, I don't know what it is. It was like the first time that I landed in New York, I had some weird familiarity with it that I didn't really have with any other place that I, I had been to apart from London. And I instantly felt at home. I felt like I could find my way around. The people were like friendly. It felt like the kind of place where I could just go and even if I was on my own, I would never be alone. And so that's why it felt like home. But I love New York a lot. So, <laughs> Alexis Serrano, where are you? Hello. <laughs> What is, this is groundbreaking, what is your favorite meme? Yes. You gotta pick. Um, of course I know what a meme is. Who said <laughs> I didn't know what a meme is? Um, I, <laughs> I feel offended now. <laughs> um, I don't, I don't actually know. Thanks, babe, I make a lot of Do you have like a favorite faces. vine? Oh. What is that? I don't, I don't know her. I don't really... Uh, this I, is a toughie on the spot. It's really tough. How dare you, Alexis? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, it's really tough. What's your favorite meme? There's a new rules meme. There's a new rules meme? You gotta go with that. I know, but I feel like... Oh, the don't let do a leave with that. That's really sweet. That's good, but I feel like... I, I'm not gonna pick my own meme. <laughs> um... I don't know. I don't know. This that's is fair. Too, that's fair. This is too I put tough. you on the spot. It's fine. Ashley Romeo. Hello. Ashley would like to know what is the lyric you're most proud of on DL1? Oh, that's. Um, that's like, you got to pick between your babies. I know, right? It's, it's kind of tough. Like, every, every song comes from like a, a different, different part. Um, Hashtag Genesis should be a single. Genesis is a very honest. What did you say? Hashtag Genesis should be a single. I didn't say it, but I believe it. <laughs> it's just so good. I'm oh, sorry. Thank you. Well, thank you so much. It's a, it's a, it's a very honest song, and, and it means a lot to me. And um, I, I love that you guys love that song. And, and, you know, before the album came out, I started performing it on tour. So it is one that's really close to my heart. Um, but, yeah, I, I couldn't pick one lyric that I'm, I'm really attached to. I, well, if y'all have a favorite lyric, use hashtag new rules live with the lyric. I'll be looking. Um, Brock would like to know, who, where's Brock? Hello. Hi. So Brock is turning 12 today. Happy birthday. Wait, I feel like we should sing happy birthday. Guys, you guys ready to sing happy birthday? Give us vocals. Ready? Wait, all of us together, don't leave me on my own because happy birthdays, I can't do it so well. You ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear bro. Happy birthday to you. Woo! Happy birthday, darling. <laughs> My heart melts. Thank you for being here with us. On your Brock birthday. also has a question, though. Brock, okay, wants, okay, Brock has some question. investigative journalism I'm sorry, I'm to get not, to. I'm not taking that away from you. <laughs> Brock would like to know, what does it feel like to perform in front of thousands of people? I mean, that's got to be bonkers. It's, it's nerve-wracking. It's super scary. I get... I, I guess when the adrenaline hits, when I, when I go on stage, it's the most fun feeling in the world. It's all the butterflies and everything. It's... it's so amazing. There's no feeling quite like it. Um, but yeah, every time it's a different feeling and every time it's so special. But thank you so much, Brock, for your lovely question. I do have to say, Brock knew all the lyrics. When you were performing, Brock was like... <laughs> I was like, yes, it's work. Oh, I love it. Family well, thank affair. Thank you for bringing it. So uh, I got to know, can you please tell us next single? What can fans expect? Everyone's clamoring. I'm like looking at my team, but no one's, no, I can't see anyone here. 
That's we, giving well, we got me a heads right up. It's so, um. That you're gonna <laughs> what do you guys want? <laughs> what? <laughs> I literally have no idea what anyone's saying. Oh, you're saying? I thought you were asking me what well, my next single it, is going to be. It is this one, yeah. Oh, the, right. Okay. Never mind. I obviously didn't get the question. Um, are we ready to perform? <laughs> Can you, you perform the next single? Is I'm my not going to tell you what. What? Whatever. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm going to get up and sing one last song for you guys. That's what we're going for. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what? All right. This one, I'm hoping some of you know. Uh, and if you do, please. Please sing along with me. Um, I want to thank you all so much for all your questions and for being here. And to everyone live streaming at the moment, thank you so much. Um, you guys have been so much fun. This is, I'm going to break this. It's not, sis, it's not working. <laughs> all right, we did it. All right, this is called New Rules. Talking in my sleep at night, making myself crazy. What? Out of my life, out of my mind. Wrote it down and read it out, hoping it would save me. Too many times, too many times. Love, it makes me feel like nobody else, nobody else. So I tell myself, I tell myself, come on, hey, one, don't pick up the phone. You know he's only calling because he's drunk and alone. Two, don't let him in. You have to kick him out again. Three, don't be his friend. You know you're going to wake up in his bed in the morning. And if you're under him, you ain't getting over him. I got no rules, I count them. Hey, I got no rules. I gotta tell them to myself I got news I count them I gotta tell them to myself I keep pushing forward But he keeps pulling me backwards No matter turn, no matter turn Now I'm standing back from it I finally see the pattern I never learn, I never learn from my me so I tell myself, I tell myself, I do, I do, I do. One, don't pick up the phone. You know he's only calling because he's drunk and alone. Two, don't let him in. You have to kick him out again. Three, don't be his friend. You know you're gonna wake up in his bed in the morning. And if you're under him, you ain't getting over him. I got no rules, I count them. I got no rules, I count them. I gotta tell them to myself. I got no rules, I count them. Practice makes perfect. I'm still trying to learn it by heart. I got no rules, I count them one Don't pick up the phone You know he's only calling cause he's drunk and alone Two, don't let him in You have to kick him out again Three, don't be his friend You know you're gonna wake up in his bed in the morning And if you're under him You ain't getting over him I got no rules, I count them I love you guys I got no rules, I count them I gotta tell them to myself. I got no rules, I count them. I gotta tell them to myself. Thank you so much.
know what is happening. No, I but, don't. But uh, before we go, there's a little tradition on YouTube where uh, when you reach a million subscribers, <laughs> you are presented with something very special if you want to open it. I would love yeah. to. Yeah. Now, there's something you should know. Uh, Dua Lipa, you get a, uh, a plaque for reaching a million subscribers. And not only did you reach a million subscribers so fast, you're already at two million, so. That's insane. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. <laughs> Thank you so much to everyone who came out tonight and hung out with us uh, here at the U2 space in New York City. Thank you to Dua Lipa, everybody. Again, get the new album, support new rules. Uh, and if you want to say anything before we go. I want to say thank you so much. Thank you for coming down. I love you so, so, so much. Thank you for making my dreams come true. I love you and I'll see you soon. Mwah.